Flake here with your news briefing. It's expected COVID booster shots will start rolling out across the country from November 8. Australia's drug regulators given the green light for anyone over 18 to get a third dose of Pfizer, no matter what vaccine you got first. The TGA's Professor John Skerritt says those who are double-vaxxed need to wait a bit before considering a third dose. At least six months. And again, it doesn't mean that everyone needs to front up on six months and one day. It's again at least six months uh, after the completion of the COVID vaccine primary series. While rapid antigen tests will become available over the counter from next week to COVID cases across the country, there's been 1,534 new infections and 13 deaths in Victoria overnight. New South Wales has reported 304 new cases and three deaths. There's been 10 local infections in the ACT and no new cases in Queensland. Staying in the Sunshine State and its health minister's making no apologies about a vaccine vaccine mandate for its health workers. Staff yet to get the jab will be out of work from Monday, with more than 2,000 across the sector already having applied for exemptions. Yvette Darth says safety needs to remain paramount. They are dealing with the most vulnerable people in our community. New South Wales has had people, even as recent as the last week, come into the hospital system and actually contract the virus while in a public hospital and then died from it. And the cost of living has gone up over the September quarter. The latest inflation figures show a rise of 0.8% of a percent over the three months, while there's been a 3% rise over the past year. Get personalised hair loss treatment in five minutes delivered to your door. Clinically proven treatment for men and women. One pill taken daily. Thehairypill.com.au The D's are shooting to launch their Premiership Cup tour in mid-November. It's going to go national. However, the first stage will remain in Victoria due to COVID restrictions. Fremantle's D listed Mitch Croden and Connor Blakely but they're staying with the club. The Dockers have committed to pick them up again in the AFL rookie draft and in Sheffield Shield action, Victoria's hit 199 with New South Wales now batting, Queensland still batting against Tasmania while WA won the toss and elected to bowl against South Australia. Buying or selling rural or residential properties, Miller, Juan and John. This is SAFM Weather. A chance of a thunderstorm on the limestone coast this evening as we drop to 12 degrees overnight. Tomorrow, showers increasing 19. Friday, more showers 15. For radio, podcasts, music and news, download the free listener app.